Hey Capricorn, I hope you're doing well. This is going to be a general reading for April 21st through the 30th. Any information you need, you can find it down below. Um, Capricorn, I do have my four-month-old sleeping behind me and I have my Airedale sleeping across the room. So just bear with me if you hear some weird noises. It's probably just one of them snoring, okay? I do have personals open as well. There are three different options. They're starting at $20. Details are down below this video in the description box. You're starting with the Two of Wands, okay, Capricorn? Um, so, you know, Two of Wands, he's got the world in his hands there. There could be a big decision that you're trying to make here, um, some plans that you're trying to make. I feel like you have a lot of different options in a situation here. Um, he's got the world in his hands in that card. This is somebody who has the ball completely in their court in a situation. What's going on here? Two of Swords, another two. Okay, so yeah, definitely a decision to make here. It could be between two people, two jobs, two different paths. Truly, I feel like a lot of you have more than one path to take. So definitely make sure that you're keeping your mind open to different avenues here in a situation because uh, neither of these paths could be the path that you need to take. You do have the Page of one showing up here. I feel like a conversation has been avoided with this Fire Sign here or with this Pisces or Libra. Maybe a Cancer for some of you, but um, yeah. I feel like there's been a little bit of a standoff here. What's going on? What's going on with the Two of Wands? The King of Wands, we got Leo Energy. We have the star showing up. You have a brand new desire here is how this is feeling. Like you are in an energy Capricorn of wanting something brand new is kind of the vibe that I'm sensing. The star is rebirth. It's like, I want to reinvent myself. I want something new. Like this is my new passion. This is my new, like this is the life I desire. This is the new vision I have for myself. Um, you know, I, I see you trying to move forward, you know, and in the two of wands, he is clutching that wand ahead. As a matter of fact, like you want a brand new world here. Whatever this wand is here, you're done with it. You're wanting to leave it behind. Like the fire is out. The passion is, is gone from it basically. But you have this two of swords here in the middle all right so this can be like a stagnant or stuck energy so maybe you're kind of stuck in the situation um you know just out of familiarity you're kind of staying there even though you have a new desire here um you know but for for a lot of you i truly feel like this is something that you can't get out of your head like something is is stuck there basically it's like no matter how you look at it it's still there and there's no you don't understand why you're still thinking about it here. The Chariot got Cancerian energy and the Queen of Pentacles got Capricorn energy. I think you invested a lot of time in something, okay? Um, see, but I don't know if this is your energy or someone else's with that court card showing up. Knight of Pentacles, it looks like someone else's since we got another court card here. Um, you know, I do feel like somebody's being very cautious, kind of walking on eggshells, trying to figure out the right words to say to you here. Capricorn, but you know, you have the chariot showing up. I think this is one big reason that they're having such a hard time is because they're feeling like you've moved on while well, they've just tried to preserve things, even though they've not really done that on a physical level. It's only been energetically. They've been trying to figure out how to fix something or how to go about something. I feel like this is driving them crazy with the two of swords. Like it's stopped, like it's like put a complete halt to their productivity, to, you know, other things in their life here. Uh, you know, so I feel like this is something that uh, this person just can't get out of their head here. So I do feel like they're going to be getting some kind of message with the Page of Wands energy. What's going on with this? What's going on with the Page of Wands? Four of Swords, yeah. I feel like it's going to be an awkward message. You're going to be able to tell that there's a lot below the surface. There's a lot that's not being shared with you here. The Seven of Cups. I feel like it's only going to be... Like, there's going to be a lot of confusion and mixed signals, okay? The hangman, it might be a Pisces. It might involve a Pisces here, but they have a lot of fire for you, for sure. Um, but there's just so many mixed signals or, you know, it's almost like they're uncertain. They feel like you have moved on. So, um, you know, I feel like they're wanting some kind of clue that you haven't before they say much else, you know? I feel like they're almost kind of manipulating the communication, in a sense, to try to get you to say something or admit to something here, Capricorn. It's really weird energy, okay? It's a really awkward uh, time there when this takes place. <laughs> might be a Virgo or a Gemini, but yeah, that's what I'm sensing here. This person's been watching you work or watching you move on from something here, Capricorn. And basically, I feel like they're going to try to manipulate communication in a sense. It's kind of awkward, like ask ask really um, like targeted questions. It's so odd. Um, you know, like if you're in a relationship, for example, they may ask how your relationship is. It's like, you know, they're just wanting to know what's going on there in that aspect of life. So they know, you know, they can kind of gauge what kind of chances they have. It's, it's something like that here. It's so weird. Oh my goodness. That was so loud. Uh, that's what I'm seeing, Capricorn. I hope this was helpful. There are details down below for anyone who might be interested in a personal, okay? But if this is where we part, thank you for watching this far. I really appreciate you, and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye.